Hi friends, this is Manish Pandey. Welcome back. This is session 2 of Excel as a database automation video series. Here you will see what are the prerequisite to use Excel as a database in UiPath. Prerequisite to use Excel as a database in UiPath is first you have to install Microsoft Access Database Engine 2010. This will be a 64 bits or 32 bits based on your Microsoft Office. Here in my scenario, I have 64 bits of Microsoft Office installed in my system and also I have 64 bits of operating system but I am using 32 bits of Microsoft Access Database Engine 2010. So it depends but you can try installing based on your Microsoft Office that version that beats. If it is 64, first try to install Microsoft Access Database Engine 2010 64 bit. If that does not work, you have to uninstall this one and then you have to install 32 bits. Let me show you. Open this Chrome browser and then search here Microsoft Database Engine 2010. So you will see here Microsoft Access Database Engine 2010 and then you need to click on download. Select here this one, click on next and then it will download this exe. Now this has been downloaded. Here in the download folders I have this exe Access Database Engine 2010. Double click on that. We need to install this Microsoft Access Database Engine 2010. Click next. Select this, click next, click install. Now this has been successfully installed, click OK. Second, you have to install uipath.database.activities package in your uipath studio. So in uipath studio, click on manage packages. In the all packages, search here uipath.database.activities. Install this, click on save. Now this has been installed in UiPath Studio and we are going to use Excel 2013 version. In the next video, we will see how to connect UiPath with Excel as a database. If you want to learn Blue Prism, please visit my YouTube channel youtube.com slash Blue Prism RPA. And also if you want to learn Blue Prism from Udemy, and you want to get certificate you can search for my blue prism course th there that is blue prism rpa complete course i will also put the link in in my video description you can go through that there thank you